What's up my people, Rand here. I'm super excited to talk to you guys today because I'm, I'm gonna tell you about how to play any multimedia format on your Mac OS devices, no matter if you have a MacBook Air, Pro, iMac, or Mac Mini with a video player for Mac. Afterwards, I'll give a quick review of its most useful features and tell you why it's one of my favorite video players for Mac OS, L Media Player. Let's get into it, folks. So how do you play any movie, video, or audio file on your Mac for free? Nowadays, in times of our digital reality, you'll probably run out of fingers counting how many video and audio codecs and formats there are out there. AVI, MP4, MKV, WMV, MP3, and tons of other letters, all but a few users will bother with. You just want to play a file downloaded from the internet, or which you already have on your computer quickly and without loss of quality. If you need to open a media file on your Mac, the first thing that usually comes to mind is to use QuickTime. The default player already installed on your Mac OS device in order to avoid long searches and save your time. While that's alright, you should know that there aren't a lot of formats QuickTime can't play. To find the best way to play any video and audio format on Mac, let's do a little experiment together. Alright, I have several files in the most used audio and video file formats. AVI, MKV, MOV, MP4, WMV, WMA, FLV, FLAC, OGG, MP3. I'll open each of these with QuickTime and see what happens. Wow, that's just sad. QuickTime can't open MKV or FLV AVI files. QuickTime can't even play WMV nor WMA. If this was a test, QuickTime only got a 40%, which is a failing grade no matter how you look at it. So if you're just relying on QuickTime to play your media files on Mac OS by default, you're severely limiting your options. But don't despair. All you have to do is find and download a third-party player that supports almost all known video and audio formats and can open them in a few clicks without using any additional codecs. After seeing QuickTime's shortcomings, that might sound impossible. Honestly though, that's more QuickTime's problem than it is media players for Mac OS in general. I said before I really like L Media Player, and I'm going to show you why over 2 million users agree with me. Let's download and install it and give our experiment one more go. First, let's drop the files that wouldn't open with QuickTime into this player. Using an MKV file, one that QuickTime couldn't play, remember? I'll run down the three ways to show how to open a file with L Media Player. Firstly, you can move your file directly to the L Media Player's window or to its icon on the dock. Or you can use the right button on your mouse and click on your file. In the drop-down menu, click Open With and choose L Media Player. Finally, you can open the file via L Media Player's main menu. Find File and click Open. Now, let's open the other file types from our experiment. Voila! L Media gets 100%. Your search for the impossible Play It All Media Player is over. As we've seen, being multi-format is one of the top features for an ideal media player. But it's not the only one. There are several features to consider when choosing a video player application. Let's take a closer look at the features L Media Player has that go above and beyond the quick times of the world, like playback adjustments, subtitle features, and streaming options. So let's begin with the playback options. We all hate it when our favorite movie's audio goes out of sync with what's going on visually. But with L Media Player, you can breathe a sigh of relief thanks to its easy playback controls. Simply click on the little hexagon in the corner and adjust the delay. At the same window, you can see further settings to make your watching experience even better. With a video tuner, you can play with brightness, saturation, contrast, and gamma with a drag of their sliders. Easy. In the Equalizer tab, you can sort through our carefully selected presets or take things into your own hands or ears with the manual setting. Maybe you have a bass-heavy pair of headphones that you need to tone down a bit. Or perhaps you listen to a lot of EDM, electronic dance music, but the treble is too sharp and needs to be pulled back. Whether you're looking for more punch, a warmer sound, or a bass that will rattle your insides, an EQ helps you dial in the sound that suits you best. However, there are those occasions where your video suffers a snafu. Stripes, line crawling, or blur. No worries. 
With L Media Player's de-interlace option, you can enhance the video quality. Go to L Media Player, Preferences, Video. The View Settings option is also very useful. Once in a while, we all get a video that was made vertically or, or sideways. It just doesn't display properly, so just go to View and choose Flip, Mirror, or Rotate to get a perfect video view. Subtitle support is also very important in choosing a good video player. Many of us use subtitles to watch movies. Whether it's for a foreign language film or if we just want to watch with the sound off, subtitles are incredibly useful. If we're trying to learn another language, subtitles are a very useful tool that help you understand the flow of the language in a much more natural format. And since the OpenSubtitles.org platform is directly integrated into the L Media Player interface, you can find the desired subtitle track just in a few minutes. L Media Player even lets you increase or decrease subtitle delay to make sure they sync with the video in case the original file has some issues. Click the hexagon you'll see the settings. You can also play with colors and fonts and set the size and color for text and background of subtitles. L Media Player supports a broad swath of different languages, even ones that read right to left, like Hebrew or Arabic. Choose your preferred language and enjoy. And now for the icing on the cake, streaming options. You can enjoy watching your local files on the big screen of your smart TV, no matter if you have LG, Roku, Samsung, or many other DLNA-enabled streaming devices, and high quality is guaranteed. Yes, please! Compile your own unique playlists in L Media Player and stream it all interrupted to your large TV screen. L Media even supports streaming with embedded or external subtitles. What's not to love? Now you know how to play any video or audio format on your Mac and what you should be looking for when it comes to a good media player. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave your comments under this video and I'll do my best to get back to all of you. Don't forget to share this video on social media along with your impressions and concerns. Thanks for watching.